From a design or product development standpoint, you're always trying to make high performance product. You have to build it to a target price. It has to look beautiful. But I think like the modern fourth attribute is trying to make a product that does less harm. We were already using bioresin in our skis and core material is just the next logical step. Two years ago, Dave from HL Sports called me. He was kind of curious, like, what are you, what are you guys up to? You know, we had looked at other alternatives, but nothing really stuck. And looking at what Checker Spot was doing with their foam and how it was working in the Wonder Alpine skis and snowboards at the time, it just looked like a great fit. There was an opportunity to kind of intersect the projects between what we were able to bring to market through Wonder Alpine, illuminating his interest to explore potentially the use of an algal-derived rigid polyurethane core for skis. Microalgae is just a single cell organism. Rather than feeding sugar to yeast to generate alcohol for beer, we feed sugar to microalgae to produce oil. It's just a better way of making plastics that can easily be made in foam. It's like totally logical. I think Checker Spot was stoked because we build our high-end skis in America so we could do our development right outside Seattle. We were able to build skis right away. In days, get a feedback loop back to the material science team that, oh, we need to increase density here. We machine all our cores in-house, so we can literally take those different densities of foam, cut them into core blanks, and press skis right there in Seattle, go to the, go to the lake and ride them. We were able to arrive to a pretty quick conclusion of how to get to their needs. What sets Saver apart from anything in the industry is it's got to be the material. I mean, it's the first time anyone's used a bio-based foam material in a water sports product. Today I got to ski on the prototype Saber. Just standing up on that ski looking down, it's the exact same emotion I got the first time and still to this day the emotion I get skiing our alpine skis to just know that you're on something totally different. For like 90% of the skis we produce, it's excellent material. In fact, I prefer it to the standard petroleum-based polyurethane because we do have it in a lighter density. So you do have a little bit more reactivity. It has that nice forgiving polyurethane feel, but a little bit more performance because it's lighter and the ski feels a little snappier and more, more reactive. I feel a big responsibility to try and bring more environmentally friendly products to the water sports industry. I don't think there's any application you can come to market with to validate innovation that isn't built on renewable or bio-based technologies. And the cool thing is these awesome materials like Checker Spot's producing, you can do both. You can have a great performing product and do less harm. That's the dream from a product development design standpoint.